There have been days of eager anticipation prior to this massive clash, but now we need to talk about it no more and instead focus on the here and now. A match that has the capacity to delight and dazzle no matter who you support. Keep it right here with us, the home of football, EA TV. Hello from Villa Park, a football venue since the 19th century and still one of the best today. My name's Guy Mowbray, Sue Smith is alongside me for commentary and we've got action from the Premier League here today. It's Aston Villa versus Manchester City. Yeah, cheers guys, it's great to be here. I think it's important that both teams are focused from the off though and they start quickly, but I'd love to see some goals. Hopefully I've not just cursed it. Here's today's Aston Villa team. Yeah, it looks to be a 4-4-2 and you'd expect the two strikers to occupy both centre-backs. When they attack, they'll combine and the wide midfielders, they'll get forward to provide crosses for them both. This is the Manchester City starting eleven. Edison is between the posts. Ruben Diaz starts alongside John Stones in the centre of defence. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Rodri in the middle of the park. And the main man in attack is Erling Haaland. And the work pays off as they get the ball back. Phil Foden. And the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. Douglas Luiz. Esri Consa. It's nice possession. Is there a goal to take the lead coming? John McGinn. City recovering possession well. Maybe a bit of space now. And it's cleared away from goal. Congratulations, Mike and Eileen. Grealish. They're getting into a good position. A good advantage played by the ref. Encouraging signs to the attack, but it hasn't led to anything. And the ball is lost. Problems now for them. No problem at all in keeping that one out. Moving forward under no real pressure. Found nicely and in. Walker. Bowden. Guardiol. able to come away with the ball Hammerer this could be dangerous can he finish it's in a well taken goal and no wonder he's off celebrating well take a look at this the pace they show on transition it's just so impressive the defenders can't stay with them, but then there's still plenty to do. He's under all sorts of pressure from the defender. He's just about able to keep him at bay. It's a really good goal. Well, is there to be a response from Manchester City now as they get the game going again? This might be promising. Oh, they looked in there. That's nicely cut out. Breaking at pace. This could be dangerous. They need to get bodies back. Silva. Silva. 
Grealish. Rodri. Bernardo Silva. Surely the equaliser. Douglas Luiz. Diaby. A turnaround in possession. Excellent positioning. And with that, the first half at Villa Park comes to an end. Well, of all the players we're watching today, would you agree that he'd certainly get good marks so far? Yeah, and I think he's had a really good first half. Not only his goal, which he took well, but his overall performance. I'm sure he'll look to continue that in the second half. As the second half kicks off, Manchester City need to find a response. Trying to spark the attack further into life here. That got a touch out. Throw in now. Grealish. Now Haaland. A little sloppy on the ball there. Grealish. They could level it here. Oh, superb save. He's done so well to keep that out. Played into the box. And you really have to beat the first defender. Counter-attack coming. Away they go. Oh, that's not a good challenge at all. Card coming here, surely. And he has been booked for that. Yeah, he had no option. That's a yellow for me. And they've lost it now. Haaland. Looking for someone at the back post here. Oh my goodness. He's caught that so well. It's a goal of real class. Well, we can see it here again, and it's pinpoint delivery into the danger zone. And what a goal. His body position is just right opens it up, times it to perfection, and catches it so well. It's a really nice strike. And the game restarts with the score one all. Douglas Luiz. Zaniolo. Onto Torres. What a chance here. Maybe now. Oh, they scored again. The game had only just restarted after the last one. Well, here's the replay. And just look at the way he glides past the defender. Makes it look so easy. And as soon as he's through 1v1 with the goalkeeper, he just goes for power and smashes it in the net. It's a quality finish. So off we go at 2 1 now. Jack Grealish. Consa. On to Torres. Substitution for Manchester. Ubakar Kamara. Coming off the pitch. Number 16, Rodri. To be replaced by number 8. Mateo. City being afforded too much space here. Real opportunity. Oh, you can't stop them now. 
They've got another in double quick time. Here's the replay, and it's a nice bit of skill to beat his man. Then he keeps his composure to finish it off well. It's a quality goal, that. So it's 3-1 as the ball gets rolling again. McGinn. Konsa. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick to come. And he hasn't gone in the book. That's good officiating. No need to put him in the book for that. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number three. Ruben Diaz coming onto the pitch, number 25, Manuel Akanji. Read the pass well and cuts it out. Well, we can catch up with the details on that injury now from our man, Jeff Shreves. He actually got trodden on in that last challenge, so his foot is probably a bit sore. Cheers, Jeff. And they've got it back now. Jack Grealish. Manchester City showing good width here. Good cross into the middle. And that one goes out and away. They won't take it from him there. Matty Cash. Esri Consa. Pau Torres. Dean. Bubakar Kamara. Promising looking ball. Keeps himself in the way, well held. Oh, he didn't get that right. There could be punishment coming. And the referee shows the yellow card. Well, it's a bit of a naughty challenge. Had to go in the book. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number five, John Stones, to be replaced by number six, Nathan Ake. Radio onto Grealish. Erling Haaland. On to Mateo Kovacic. The counter looks on here. Options available. They have to get back at pace. But it will now be tidied up and cleared away. Well, there's the final whistle. And it's Manchester City who take the three points. Yeah, it was a fairly comfortable result in the end. They control large parts of the game. It's a real professional performance. And I think they deserve the result. Well, Erling Haaland is a handful and then some for any defender. What are your thoughts on his performance today, Sue? Yeah, it's a good performance from him and his teammates. Finished well for his goal, great work, great throughout. I'm sure he'll be happy with that.